Welcome back. I'm an engineer whose girlfriend wants to start a pottery studio. I bought a kiln off Facebook Marketplace to prove my girlfriend wrong. She said it would be too hard to repair a pottery kiln, so I bought one without her knowing and have been repairing it with you guys. Um, you're all now accomplices. Congratulations. Um, if you say anything, you're going down with me. <laughs> Previously, we've been polishing and sanding a layer of this kiln. Today, we finish up the electronics. Now that the project manager has arrived, we can finally get started. You want to be a part of the video? So much brighter, much more shiny. It's pretty sweet. So, And after admiring my own efforts with the painting process, I carried on to reinstalling the wiring. After my negotiation with the ground wire, I began to see the final results start to take shape and obviously could not contain my excitement. Dude, heck yeah, look at that. That was a challenge. Good as new. Look at that, it's beautiful. Boom, bam. Look at how clean, brand new. Wow, like I never tore it apart. Oh, look at that shine, amazing. How we're going to put this on the layer is these, these stainless steel screws. The ones that came with it are, I don't know what they're made out of, maybe some kind of like zinc deposit or something. Instead, stainless steel screws, they're a little beefier. They're gonna self tap right into the, the soft brick. It is gonna be pretty sweet. Polished ring, wow, shing, shing. First, we put on our reflective heat shield because heat comes in IR waves. And if the inside of this is reflective, it bounces back some of the heat and keeps the heat heat away from the electronics. So this is a little fun tidbit. Science, kind of fun. That'd be my best guess. I'm no Scut engineer, but uh, Scut, if you're watching, I can use a job. So I don't know if y'all remember way back when, but this thing was dirty. Crazy reflective. Electrical box is redone completely. Super shiny. Looks pretty good. Kind of like the first paint job I've ever done, especially high heat. So brick looks good. This layer is complete. Lastly, let's just review the conclusion of our labor for this small part. I want to thank you. I sincerely appreciate everyone taking time and especially to all the helpful advice you've given. There have been so many comments that I truly appreciate, but I found this one particularly interesting because it explains that the ring that we have been polishing and repainting is an expansion layer that adds space for when you fire the kiln. Um, just wanted to share with everyone i thought it was pretty cool in the next video we dig into the big center with all the crazy electronics and heating element and broken brick it'll be definitely interesting <laughs> so see you in the next one